Hey guys, what's up? Today we are going to be making a super tasty toucan tart. Uh, no toucans were harmed in the making of this tart. It is a fruit tart with a pastry cream. Alright, let's get straight into it. Go ahead and crush. watching this until it comes up to a simmer. Low simmer. So while our mix is coming up to a simmer, I'm just going to go ahead and mix our flour and sugar with our egg yolks. Uh, the recipe says to really incorporate those two together and make kind of an egg, flour, sugar slurry. And then once the milk is simmered, we're going to add, slowly add some simmering milk to this mixture to temper the eggs. And then once those are tempered, we're going to add everything back to the pot and bring that back up to a simmer to thicken it. to go on our tart. We've got bananas, mango, some passion fruit, and kiwi. So once the toucan is done baking and cooled, we will assemble everything. And delicious looking passion fruit. Alrighty, everything is ready. We've got the delicious crust, the toucan, our fruit selection, some green buttercream I've thinned down for the toucan's beak and also some vanilla pastry cream. So this is a little hack that I just learned and if you put a little bit of jam down on your pastry crust it will stop your cream from sogging at the bottom of this delicious crispy base. So I'm going to go ahead and do that now. And this is a passion fruit marmalade. Really tasty.
for today's recipe. We've got this beautiful tart here. Really happy with how this cute little toucan turned out. I think the only thing that I would have done differently is I would have put the fruit around like a bit more evenly so that every person, you know, every slice got a little bit of each fruit, the uh, kiwi, banana, and the mango. But this way, I guess if you have someone who doesn't like a specific fruit, they can choose which fruit they do like. So that works out. Thank you.